Guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercard, episode 183. Ah, oh, what a disappointing fucking start to this video. Let me quickly explain to you guys why. So, I have downloaded OBS, I downloaded Bluestacks, because I can't for some reason download LeapDroid. And uh, I recorded a video. I recorded episode 183. And uh, what happened is I, um, I played some Ring Dom. I opened my uh, team Battleground Awards, and I proed Seth freaking Rollins event card. And I go to open the file, um, be like, oh, yeah, let me have a quick check if the audio is okay, if the video is okay, and then quickly get this on YouTube. But no, apparently OBS was recording in some weird file type, and uh, and yeah, um, not not only that. Well, it was just I couldn't really even if I could probably change the file type, it just wouldn't be even remotely good enough to upload onto YouTube. Um, I had the overlay, I had my face cam, I had my best deck, my last pull, all of that webcam, all of that good stuff, and. Um, and yeah, the the gameplay the gameplay was just lagging so so much. Barely could even play a game of Ringdom. But hopefully now it should be really yeah really good. It feels good now. You can only see the gameplay. Uh, no webcam, no overlay, unfortunately. So with me who has OCD, um, you guys probably it won't annoy you as much. But for me, it really frustrates me because. Well, I like having an overlay, I like having a webcam, I like being able to, I like all of that stuff, and it just feels very, very blank right now, but anyway, um, so yeah, I've, I've done a lot of the stuff I wanted to do in the video, so unfortunately I can't do that, but what we're going to do is talk a little bit about our loss in Battleground. So we've just equalised um, the Undertaker streak, which is 23-2, and two. we were 21-1, and one, which is what Undertaker had as well, so it's very weird, very, very weird, and at this point, I think we've done amazing, we've got to the 20 and 0 part, we, you know, we made that, that landmark, that is great, really happy, I think it's time for us to start counting our Battleground wins and losses, just doesn't care anymore, uh, now that we've got more than like one loss. Uh, big congratulations to our opponents in Battleground, they did really well, um, and yeah, just some people in, the, in our team weren't able to uh, energise enough, so yeah, we lost, but that's how it is, we move on, bit annoyed about it, but it is what it is. Um, so yeah, there is one member has left, James, um, let me know if what if you left on your own, if, or if someone kicked you, because I didn't, so uh, yeah, how come you left, but I've already filled your spot in the team. Uh, so yeah, I'm sorry, man. If uh, if if you know you wanted to, well, no. If if you left, you know there must have been a reason. And if someone kicked you, well, there was a reason to that. Just yeah, couple couple of, couple people in the team haven't been energizing, uh, charging in battleground over the last couple months, and I'm asking them constantly. You know, are you gonna stop? playing the game, let me know so I can kick you, why are you going to stay, and then, you know, I won't, and, you know, make an effort, <coughs> fat boy, cough, cough, <clears throat> yeah, fat boy, yeah, yeah, pick it up, man, please, we need you, man, we need you on, uh, we need you back on top as the grinder you are, so anyway, um, what we're going to do is Seth Frickin' Rollins is already pro is we're going to go level him up, we are going to go level him up, so let me, let me take you to Seth Rollins at least, he is over over here. Haven't leveled him up at all, um, but this is him with the title picture, the background of the card with flames and lightning. It looks absolutely sick. Really, really like it. Let's let's train up this card. We definitely have enough to train him up. We're gonna we're gonna be ruthless and get rid of some Ultima pros we really don't need. Um, we can say goodbye to Kofi. We can say goodbye to AJ. And we'll say goodbye. We'll say goodbye to the other AJ. Um, no, we'll say goodbye to Brock. Yeah, let that 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 alone. Brock Lesnar alone would have leveled him up to 55. But we'll chuck in some other cards there because you know we've got so many cards I need to get rid of. Level 55. There we go. So he's a speed charisma guy. He will go with power and then two in the toughness. Yeah, that's what we're gonna go with. Brilliant, and done, and done. Let's see what that looks like. Let's see how good he is already. So he's better than the Bailey, not even better than Sean. But obviously, none of his games have been played, so that is understandable. 
He prob oh okay, so he's got better speed already, not better charisma, but he's got already better power. He won't have better toughness, and he definitely will have better all heal power. But I don't know. I don't know where Seth Rollins is going to come on this list. I hope I hope he's number one. I hope he's before Matt, but I don't think I don't think so. I don't think so. So, what other cards do we have to combine? We've got Eddie Guerrero and Samojo left. Eddie Guerrero and both Samojo will be done in the next episode, guys. I guarantee you that. Um, so, yeah, let's get into some uh, ring domination gameplay. Already got the ultimate, which was AJ Styles. If you guys want to know who the WrestleMania is, then I what I'm about to tell you. If not, mute the video for the next... Five seconds. The WrestleMania is Randy Orton, which does fuck all to my deck because I already got him like five times. And if you guys have just unmuted, welcome back. <laughs> um, so yeah, I I've, I, let, I let the people know if you didn't if you muted who the WrestleMania is. Um, yeah, we won't even talk about it anymore. It's Randy Orton. Ha! <laughs> Get wrecked. Sorry. I just know that none of you muted the video. I'm that I'm that faithful in the fact that none of you I I'm faithful. I well I strongly believe that none of you muted because I don't think many people care. And at this point, most of the grinders already know who, that. Well, everyone knows it's Randy Orton. And this far into the tier, no one really cares. Uh, left arrows. I've got an up arrow, but it's going to be risky to use the up arrow. But I suppose I'll get games played on both of them. I'm currently watching TNA as well, because um, I've finally got Spike TV here in England. I don't have Spike back in Switzerland, so I just, you know, watch it on, you know, watch wrestling <laughs> online. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, El Patron, uh, Bobby Lashley is tonight, after, after Slammiversary, second, uh, arguably first or second best pay-per-view of the year for TNA. Uh, last Sunday, that was all good, uh, quite enjoyable actually, um, it was the unification, what well, main event was the unification of the Global Force Wrestling Championship and the TNA Championship, the Impact Wrestling Championship, um, Bobby Lashley against El Patron, formerly known as Del Rio in WWE, and the winner of that match, to probably no surprise, Alberto El Patron, um, so yeah, he is the unified champion, so that's pretty cool. Enjoying TNA right now. Yeah, I am enjoying TNA actually. Slammiversary was pretty damn good. And a match that I thought was going to be goddamn awful turned out to be probably my favourite match of the night. And that was um, Jeremy Borash um, with uh, Fake Abyss and Scott Steiner and uh, Josh Matthews. So yeah, I actually really enjoyed that. It was it was a really good match. Uh, Sharkboy returned. Uh, Abyss returned. Um... Abyss's manager, who I forgot his name, returned. I knew, I know he used to be in TNA with Abyss right at the beginning, and he got a bit, he got quite a decent pop. Um, but yeah, I'm forgetting his name right now. I am forgetting his name. All right, guys, Ring Dom. It feels nice to play with that lag. I don't know why when I was recording with OBS, it was just unbearable to play. Unbearable. So I hope you guys understand. At least I can record and get videos for you guys uh, from here in England. I w I'm going back to Switzerland, going back to my uh, my own my setup and all of that good stuff on Tuesday night. So there'll be a video for you guys out on probably on Tuesday. Well, I don't may I don't know maybe on Wednesday. I might just be tired on Tuesday night getting in. But I'm gonna try and record a couple more videos while I'm here. Um, maybe you know getting that John Cena event card. So, yeah, what I wanted, what I said in the video I actually recorded before, and obviously there's a lot of things I said then that I forgot to say now, but when I ended my last episode, episode 182, um, I had no idea who the next event card is, and about 10 minutes after that, uh, D2 posted a picture in, um, in the Discord chat with on the catalogue there being a picture and a slot for the John Cena. First I was like, ah, this is fake, bullshit, whatever. And then, you know, I was like, oh, very possible, actually. John Cena, he returned, 4th of July shit, all of that. Made, it would make sense, definitely. Um, so, yeah. And then Supercard tweeted out about half an hour later, confirming that it's John Cena. I was going to record a video to let you guys know that it was John Cena, but just thought you guys, you know, wouldn't, wouldn't be a great video. Hey, guys, yeah, event card is uh, no one, because you can't see him. End of the episode, thank you, goodbye. So, yeah. 
wouldn't have made for a great video, but yeah, I'm I'm, I'm okay. I'm I'm quite happy with the fact it's John Cena. I, I'm I'm quite a fan of John Cena, um, especially now. Uh, you know, five years ago, couldn't stand the guy, but yeah, I'm definitely a fan fan of him now. I think I think he's good. I think he, he is he is he is good. All right, let's see. Are we? Do we even want to go for a perfect game? I suppose power would be good for me, or proc in speed or toughness. We've got power and speed. Proc, yeah. Oh, so did, um, yeah, but I think, we, yeah, we've won that. Pretty cool. We can go for the perfect game here. It depends where he puts down his card. No, we can't go for the perfect game. What a shame as well. An uncommon Shawn Michaels, just a troll. Can't even challenge the card because we had no left arrows. Anyway, we've got eight picks. Let's see if we can get a shard for the video. See what we get. Probably not going to get a shard knowing, knowing my awful luck. My luck's been... My luck was really good on the AJ Styles. Really, really good. Um, and then my luck has been quite awful on this Randy Orton card. Quite awful. Okay. So, 11 choices left. We'll play one more game. Hoping, hoping we can get that shard. And I think we'll end it there. Just because it's with this internet as well I'm on. It's going to take me about an hour to get this video up. And God, just I crossed my fingers this uh, the recording has worked. I'm using QuickTime, um, so I hope it all works. I really, really hope it all works. I hope the sound is all right as well. Um, yeah, I just really hope everything everything works out. Really, really do. Okay. Get that, get some games played with that Samoa Joe. The other Samoa Joe's done is completely done. You guys knew he was done actually before. So this is the only Samoa Joe, you know. But both both Eddie Guerrero's have uh, one Eddie Guerrero's almost done. One Eddie Guerrero's about halfway. So still got quite uh, a way to go with uh, with getting Eddie Pro. But Samoa Joe is looking almost looking like he's almost there. We have no uh, no left arrows again, unfortunately. So we'll go with. We'll go with we'll go with we'll go with one of the one of the Eddies. And in case we lose this game, then we'll use the other Eddie, because if what we we lose, we lose, we might as well get some games played on the card. Uh Sean Michaels, was he mine or his? He was his. So we've lost this game. So we might as well see if we can use our Eddie Guerrero. And we can. Okay, we'll use the Eddie Guerrero just to get some extra games played on it. A power and a speed game. But it is a loss, so let's not be too happy about this. Uh, we're going to get four picks. We'll, uh, that's a, we don't have any bouts left after. No, I'm not going to wait. So, come on, give me a shard. Please, please give me a shard. We're gonna, just, let's go with the four big shards, because why not? If it is, it's probably not going to be. Uh, we're probably not going to get one. Let's see if we can get Randy's face. Last shard. And we... What a troll. Oh, you troll. You, you troll. Okay, it is. Let, let's have a quick update of uh, Ringdom. No, Ringdom will just keep. Shawn Michaels is out of it, so replace Nakamura with Shawn Michaels, Eddie Guerrero with uh, Seth Rollins Pro Event, and then Goldberg and Brock Lesnar or Undertaker. So that's how my uh, Ringdom deck would look. And let's quickly get a uh, fill all there. That's just changed by one. Bobby Roode is now my worst card. Seth is in. Once I get Eddie and Samoa Joe in, Seth Rollins will be my worst card. Uh, normal WrestleMania, which is pretty funny. Um, and yeah, we're missing a John Cena as well. John Cena is the only high-tier card we haven't got pro yet. So yeah, we're just waiting on a couple of those cards. As you can see I got that Sasha Banks pro there. So obviously we do not want a Sasha as the undercard for the RTG. We're praying for it to be Alexa Bliss. Great Balls of Fire is this Sunday as well, guys. Don't forget, I am really looking forward to it. Looking forward to a lot of things, actually. Hope this video wasn't too bad for you guys to watch. Hope the audio's okay. I hope the video's okay. If you guys have enjoyed it, and I hope you guys have, despite all the problems, I suppose, with it, then do drop it a like. Would really appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. Well, maybe not tomorrow, but I'll see you guys soon for a brand new video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Most importantly, peace. Out.